Welcome to Vista Monte. This is a property which is situated in the Kearney Valley and is close to Umberta Day in Umbria. Today we're doing a walkthrough. This is going to be a one shot, one take. We'll give you an idea of the property. I hope you enjoy it. At the end of the video, please contact us at www.abodisley.com if you have any further uh, questions. And I hope you enjoy this tour. Okay, let's go. The house sits on its own little hill and if we look around, I'll pan the camera around, you can see that the house is completely private. In the distance here is the nearest town of Umberta Day. If we come around you will see basically the woodland. And interestingly, the woodland is north facing, which is excellent because we get a lot of the cold wind from the north. Lovely bird song today. Beautiful trees. Okay, so that's a 360 degree turn. The good thing about this property is that basically it's on the north side of the Nakoni Valley, which is facing south. As you can see here, I'm taking this video approximately one o'clock. It's February 2021. Over here is our tallest mountain, which is Monte Cute, and it's a fantastic walk. You feel a little bit energetic. Right, I'm going to walk around the garden. This is an amazing fig tree. Absolutely incredible. Right, let's walk a little bit further. There's this little bit of woodland, which is here as you can see. Some nice mature olives. And coming around to the back of the house, got a lovely big olive tree here. And then we're walking over to the swimming pool area. Swimming pool, which has its winter cover on at the moment, is 12 metres by 6 metres and it's got a Roman end. Let me pull around. So, beautiful pine trees. I'll show you the back of the house. Very private. Not overlooked by anybody. It's fenced. And this is an olive grove, which is owned by the local neighbour. I'm just going to walk around directly around the house. Here you have an outside lodger in wood, and again another one here, which you can use for table tennis or seating area, or you know another table if you wish. Oh, just kick the cone. <laughs> okay, garden shed. You see the drive. There's my car. It's got two sources of water. It has town water and it has a well which is here. The gas is LPG. And if we just come around here, I'm going to walk back down, which we're walking now due south. I'm just going to show you where the gas tank is. Okay, which is just here. Um, it all has its regulation, as uh, I can see, fire extinguisher and the sign. The gas guys come and fill it up when you get low, and they do a really fantastic job. It's really private. It's a jolly nice house. Right, let's go and have a look at the inside. As I said to you, this is going to be shot in one take. I think for us at this moment in time, this is the best way for you to get a real view of the property. We're going to come in from a French door straight into the kitchen. What's nice about the kitchen is that you've got this window with a view <laughs> next to the sink. Um, here in the summer they have a big table and chairs. Um, what's good as well is that you can keep an eye on the kids and family um, 
while they're in the swimming pool and you can interact um, while you're making lunch. Hob, cooker, washing machine, refrigerator, storage cupboard. Right, moving forward. Three steps. Into the dining room. A lot of the things which are stored away for the summer. As I said, this is February. Outside seating, table. But what's really good about this house is that basically you've got a lot of double doors, a lot of space, a lot of air which is coming through, a lot of light. And if I come out here, and you'll see once the camera adjusts, that there is the swimming pool again. So you've got this real interaction between pool and house, and I think that's absolutely fantastic. Here, I would say, is what could be your main entrance. There might be a possibility of changing this and putting a glass door, you know, or a proper entrance in. Downstairs here is a bathroom. I'm just going to try to pull the camera in there. It has a shower, um, a window, which I haven't opened, so I can't get by the tractor, which is being stored just here. Now, in this cupboard um, is storage, and that's under the stairs on the outside, which I'll show you in a moment. The dining room has a fireplace, which I expect works. And then this ground floor area comes down with two stairs in two. I mean, look how bright that is. I mean, we're February. I know the sun's come out, but really lovely, bright space. Doors just closing with the wind. Here you've got your fig tree again. And I'll pull around. Another window on this side. Another fireplace. And then if you come out through here, you've got another French doors which are leading to the front of the house. And there's some beautiful wisteria, um, which I love actually. Right, so that's the ground floor. We've got kitchen, which is here, dining room, and your living room. Pull back, and then your entrance. Right, let's pop upstairs and I'll show you the bedrooms. Quite a short staircase. Nice stone work here. Okay, immediately to the left you've got kids room or guest room. It has three singles at the moment. This side which is the west side. You're overlooking the swimming pool. And if we go through the other window, you're overlooking the front of the house. What's nice, although that you are very private, you will have some twinkly lights from the town in the evening. So, I pull back. From the kids' room, you come out. There's one step down. And then you go into the second bathroom which has a shower and a sink hallway and then this leads into bedroom number two good size double fireplace which potentially could be recommissioned two windows again facing westerly and then here you've got a sink if I pan up you see it's got very nice roof tiles in terracotta and if I pan down you can see it's got terracotta flooring 
coming back into the hallway I look down there are three steps which leads into bathroom number three with a bath bidet toilets and sink and then a window which is looking out towards the front of the house immediately from there you've got bedroom number three again very bright what's nice about this room is that you can potentially pick your figs out of the window again this is shot is just blown open so I'm going to open it and then you've got a westerly aspect and then again if I pan around you'll be able to see the swimming pool as well ok so I come back out of there back into the hallway and then I'm going to go back out just to adjust for light and then you've got this lovely terrace I'll show you which is basically that's east ok and we're panning around to the south it would be very nice to sit in the afternoon looking at your view and reading a book in the shade here here which I mentioned when we looked down before with the stairs um, and underneath the stairs is the cupboard which I mentioned I'm just going to go down and we're going to pan around again no neighbours one neighbour which is just below which is over there they're an English family they live here full time they're jolly nice And that is a quick tour of Vista Monte. Again, if you have any questions, please email us. To see the full listing of this house, please go to our website, www.abodeitaly.com. Oh, did I mention it has internet? Um, but it does, which is great. Um, I look forward to talking to you soon. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you very much.